All right, guys, I'm Aaron Heiser, Makers of Leather Supply, and we are here at the 36th annual Boot and Saddle Makers Trade Show here in Wichita Falls, Texas. This is an annual event. It happens every first weekend of October. Uh, it runs on Friday and Saturday of that first weekend. Um, so today is Saturday, it's day two of the show, and we'll be packing up and heading home tonight. But first I wanted to do my walk around video and uh, show everybody what this show has to offer. It's a little bit different the, than the other shows that I do videos of. Um, this one is strictly a trade show. It doesn't have the classes and all that attached to it that the, uh, that the other ones do, like the, the Sheridan and the Pendleton and um, Prescott and all those. Um, strictly a trade show. It is geared more towards boot and saddle makers, but there are lots of great vendors here. Um, there's a lot of exotics get vended here, both because of the boot makers and things like that. Um, so as we walk through, there's going to be some new resources here that you'll, you'll be able to get from this video and, uh, and see some new faces and stuff like that. So here we go. All right, as with every other show, um, the first up to bat is always going to be the Leather Machine Company. They're always right inside the front door. Leather Machine Company brought all kinds of great machines to this uh, to this show. Um, as you know, they are the uh, pretty much the they are pretty much the industry leader as far as craftsmen and uh, their machinery and stuff. Their sewing machines are just top notch. They have a uh, a lifetime warranty on them, and uh, their customer service is also just beyond reproach. It is good stuff. That's why I'm a Cobra dealer, and that's why I have seven of their machines in my office. So, yeah. They know their stuff. Um, if you just heard the uh, over the intercom, every, all day on Saturday, I think it's every hour, they give away like $250 gift certificates to be used here at the show. And that's the, this is the only show that I know of that does that. Um, Pendleton, I think, started doing something similar. But uh, that's, uh, that's pretty awesome to have a $250 gift certificate to, uh, to the show. All right, right over here is our good friends at Vaughn Gators. All right, we'll get in on their sign here so that you can see their contact information. I've been using Mr. Vaughn's Gators for uh, all of my projects. The, the few Gators that we do sell in our shop normally come from him, but um, they are, uh, Broderick is a really good man. He, uh, he catches all of these Gators himself. Um, he's a nuisance trapper in uh, Florida and Louisiana, I believe. And uh, anyway, his gators are really good. They've, he's got some great colors. He's got some great skin. So if you're ever in the market for those, you should probably hit them up. All right, over here we have Old West Brands. Um, James Cox here does a little bit of everything nowadays. <laughs> From, uh, let's see, if there's a, a brush company. There's some saddle companies. There's auctions. There's all kinds. Of, I mean... <laughs> You should go to one of his auctions. I've actually never been, but uh, there is always some great treasures to be found in the saddle making and, and leather working world and stuff like that. But um, if you want to look up any more uh, information about them, they also uh, own the Textan brand. But there it is. There's their information right there, but they've always got some really neat stuff. I know every time I look around at their booth, they've always got something new that maybe you hadn't even seen in years and you've been looking for, but Jim, Jim normally knows where to find it. So <laughs> there we go. Thanks, Jim. All right, we're gonna walk down here. Some of these booths are kind of spread out here. All right, over here we have Keystone Leather. Looks like they do a lot of boot soles and uh, parts like that. How you doing, sir? Good, how are you? Good. I do this video, I put it on my YouTube channel, give everybody, you know, where they can find what they're looking for, maybe. Sounds good. So, um, insoles and shank covers, half soles, all kinds of boot making stuff that I don't know anything about, but I know there are people that want to make boots, so this is probably a pretty good resource for you. Just one second and I will get, do you all have a card or something? I'm gonna pause this, I'm gonna get his attention again and see if he's got a business card or something. All right, he gave me a whole flyer here. So it's uh, keystoneleather.com um, to order. It says you can email them at uh, orders at keystoneleather.com. They are based out of Williamsport, Pennsylvania. But uh, anyway, again, if you're into boot making and stuff, it seems like this would be a pretty good resource and uh, looks like they've got lots of stuff for that. So there we go. On to the next one. All right, so over here we have the Alum folks. 
Okay, so we've got a Loom Connect. We've got the uh, their video platform where uh, some of my classes can be found, as well as many, many other great classes. Um, they have some world-class instructors doing some of their videos, and then they had me do some too. So uh, anyway, the funniest part is we noticed this morning. Hang on, let me turn this around so we can get the... There I am, and then, oh, and it's, I'm not on the screen now. Hang on. Let's get back to where I'm on the screen. Look, I'm wearing the same shirt today. How dumb is that? I got like 30 of these shirts in my closet, and what do you know, I'm wearing the same one today. So, anyway, let's turn this back around here. So anyway, um, Alum Connect is also a great magazine to uh, subscribe to. There's lots of great industry information and uh, lots of great articles. Um, some years ago, they wrote one on Maker's Leather Supply, and I mean they've they've tried to match that that issue since then, but you know it was pretty much the best one they ever did. So, uh, <laughs> so anyway. Um, they're, uh, they're a great company to get involved with and to follow on social media and stuff like that. And uh, you really should look at their, uh, their subscription platform for videos because they've got stuff that you'll never find on YouTube or anywhere else. Um, really great stuff. So where's the website? There we go. There's all that connect information. All right, so uh, more information about them and what all they do can be found at alumconnect.com. Um, again, it's worth a look. Um, it really, there's so many resources there and so much stuff you can do. It's, uh, it's great stuff. So, really worth it. And I'm not just saying that because I'm part of it, but because it's true. <laughs> All right, moving along. Here is Pikes Peak Saddlery. They have a lot of acrylic templates for uh, Western type things, um, such as your spur straps and your saddle pieces and your um, breast collars and stuff like that. Um, their, uh, their templates are uh, always this bright orange color, so you'll never lose them in your shop, that's for dang sure. Um, but anyway, they've got lots of templates that guys like me, uh, makers, I don't, I don't make many of these. I, I mean, I have some, uh, some nose bands, that's about as far into this industry as I go. Um, but anyway, I'm going to give you their information here. Pikes Peak Saddlery Incorporated, uh, pikespeaksaddlery.com is where you can find their products. And uh, there's their phone number there also in case, um, in case you're looking for something that you can't find on their website that you think they might have. So there we go. Thanks, Mr. Brenner. All right, over here is my good friend Robert at Lewis Leather Sales, okay. Um, Robert uh, has all kinds of great stuff. He sells a lot of exotics. He sells a lot of shearling. He is the Southwest uh, representative for the Herman Oak uh, Tannery. Um, but he has a lot of great stuff. Uh, just yesterday I looked on his table, he has yak, yak leather. I have never seen yak leather. And I was trying to think of something stupid or funny that I could do with some yak leather because <laughs> it just sounds like it'd be fun to walk around sporting something made out of a yak. So anyway, um, Lewis Leather Sales, I know they have a website. Give me just a second to find his card. We'll get to it. Here's a whole bunch of elephant he's got at 39 bucks a square foot, which is a pretty damn good price for elephant. Thank you. But you can find Robert and his folks. Uh, they are down in Bryan, Texas, down there where uh, Texas A&M is and all that stuff, I guess. And uh, <laughs> anyway, but um, Lewis, sorry, Lewis, leathersales.com is their website and then there's their phone number right there um robert's got a lot of great stuff uh, and uh he doesn't sell crap leather at all like if he's got it it's good stuff so anyway we're gonna move over here and this is the booth of the sorry guys this is the booth of herman oak um, they don't bring leather to sell in their booth because they know guys like me have it. Um, but they do come and show off some of the things that have been made out of their leather and they're here to talk about, um, you know, their leather and what makes it what it is and why it is what it is and why they've been the industry leader for a very, very long time as far as some of the leathers that they have go. Now that bag right there is one of my backpack designs that their, um, Adam Love, their, uh, sales, um, sales manager came to my shop and learned how to make a backpack out of that is the Herman Oak 1881 leather and uh, so yeah it makes me proud that he's still carrying it around but anyway <laughs> I will walk up the other side here all right here we have Thornapple River boots 
Looks like they have some boot making um, tools and equipment and things like that. Um, let's see here. I'm going to find a card or something for them. Of course, you can see that it's basically this portion here, but then it goes down to a twister. Sorry to interrupt, sir. Do you have a card that I can get your information off of? Or even... There we go. Thank you so much. I don't know if you can... It's, That's good enough for me. It's pretty tacky. <laughs> so it's boots and saddle making tools. Um, Thorn, Thornappleriverboots.com is their website. And then there's their email address and their phone number. Um, they have lasting stands, last pullers, toe pullers, um, just all kinds of boot making stuff. They've got some beautiful all halves and things like that over here that I'm going to assume he probably makes himself. Um, but anyway, really great stuff. So give them a call again if you're looking for some boot making stuff. All right, here we have Leatherworks. All right, so www.leatherworkswks.com. All right, so this is Andrew Ternakis, and uh, he is stationed out of Florida. Luckily, he was not hit by a hurricane recently, so it went right, right around his neighborhood, so he got pretty fortunate. They've got some really top-notch leathers. They've got a ton of inventory. They have a lot of different prints and uh, embossed leathers and things like that. Um, we get some of our leathers through them, um, but they have some amazing stuff. They will sell direct to the public or through their distributors. Um, so it would behoove you to get on their website and see what all they have to offer. And uh, maybe you can find something you like and Andrew will definitely get it in a box for you and get it on its way. Thanks, Andrew. All right, Lisa is not here right this moment, but this is Lisa Sorrell's booth, Sorrell Notions and Findings. Um, Lisa has lots of great stuff for boot and shoemakers in the industry. Um, she carries a lot of products that you just won't find elsewhere unless you go overseas to find them and stuff. She does a lot of research to find that, that hard to find stuff and quality stuff. Um, I've bought quite a few things from Lisa myself just for my own projects and everything, but it's uh, www.sorrellshop or Sorrel.shop, okay. Um, she does, again, she carries a lot of great, um, a lot of great tools, a lot of great um, supplies and things like that. And uh, she is definitely worth giving a look to if you're looking for anything that you might need for boot or shoe making. Um, her boots themselves are just as good as it gets too, so. All right, moving on, Thanks, sir. Oh, I knew, here's the other part of Lisa's booth. Sorry, let's see some more stuff here. <laughs> Ooh, I'm gonna be coming back and looking at this thread. That's nice. <laughs> All right, so this is more of Lisa's stuff. She does have some, uh, some books and stuff. I know that some of them were written by her and then she carries some others written by some other folks. Um, I have this bespoke shoemaking book. It's an amazing book. And then I also have this simple sandal making book. And it's also a really, really good book. Um, Lisa herself wrote the leather inlay and overlay book here. And I don't own it, but I've heard amazing things about it. So definitely worth a look, guys. So give her a call. All right. Next, we have one of the one of the booths that I don't like to visit because I'll spend too much dang money here. But this is Solid Rock Knives. Um, so uh, they uh, they make leatherworking knives, hoof knives, um, hunting knives, all kinds of great blades and stuff. But um, David does a really good job here, and um, his knives are very reasonably priced and extremely well made. And um, yeah, another one that's definitely worth a look. So we'll get up here to his uh, his sign so we can get his contact information. There it is right there, solidrockknives.com. He is out of Georgia, and he got real fortunate too that uh, he did not get hit by a uh, hurricane just a few days ago. So we're really, really lucky for him to be able to be with us. So how's it going, Will? All right. Here we have the Hoffman Brothers. I believe they're in the Dallas area. Um, K&T Repair, I bought a clicker from them some years ago when I needed a much larger clicker than I could get from Cobra. Um, anyway, um, their number is 817-779-0072. They have some, uh, 
some great machines. Um, they sell a lot of Jukies, which are getting harder to find. Um, but they also have some, uh, again, the, the, like that big clicker right there is a 27 ton. I have one of those from him. It's a great machine. I've needed help with it once and he answered the phone immediately and he helped me immediately and we got our issue resolved immediately and it wasn't even the machine's fault. So, good people. <laughs> Um, other than that, there's my dream right there. I want that big old splitter, but you know, when the money's in the bank, maybe I'll own one, who knows? <laughs> so other than that, they've got a lot of great machines for a lot of different purposes. If you're looking for something, you can't find it, they might be worth a call and uh, they probably can, can help you out and to find what you need. Okay. Over here we've got Kelly Leather Company. Um, Mr. Kelly here um, does a lot of stuff. He does sell some exotic skins and things like that. He also um, has a boot company where he has Hello. boots made. How's it going, Mr. Kelly? Good, thank you. Um, can I get a card or something with your information on it so I can show it off here? Um, anyway, he's got some really top-notch exotic skins. I've dug through them myself and uh, we've even sold some of them at our shop. Um, but really, really good stuff. His ostrich is really pretty and uh, Mr. Kelly lives in, in my area of the world. He's down in the Waco area. Um, KellyLeatherCo.com. And his phone number is 254-855-7225. So if you're looking for something that he might be able to help you with, give him a call and I know he will. All right, here we have the folks at Thoroughbred Leather. Um, Thoroughbred Leather's been a big name in the industry. Um, they, they sell uh, tooling leather and um, harness and, and bridle and things like that. They, uh, looks like they've got some drawdown stands here this year. Um, I'm sorry? Oh, these are Brant? Okay. Right on. So they've got Brant's uh, um, drawdown stands in their booth here. But uh, they get you their contact information. All right, so. There we go, Thoroughbred Leather, phone number 502-315, bring that down some, 0315, and then as far as the website goes? Thoroughbred three, Leather KY. Thoroughbred Leather KY dot com. Yes. All righty. So if you're uh, looking for a new leather resource, I'm sure they can help you out with that. Thank you. Thanks, guys. All right. Well, this booth needs no introduction, but we'll still walk by it anyway. But here's the K Jewelers of the Leather Show. <laughs> So Barry King's booth, um, if you've never seen it in person, it is a sight to behold. Um, all the stamps that you could ever imagine, plus more that you couldn't have imagined. And uh, BarryKingTools.com, isn't it? Isn't that his yeah. website? Yeah. There's a, yeah. there's a new address now too. Oh yeah, and he does have a new address because apparently he's moved into a larger shop because, you know, he's a busy man. <laughs> I'm excited to see y'all's new shop. So. He does have a new set of tools. I picked up a set here at this show, but uh, they are the, some of the figure carving tools made the way that they're supposed to be. He collaborated with Jim Linnell, I believe, on some of these. And um, some of the old figure carving stamps that you can't find anymore because they haven't made, made the right way for years. So anyway, um, Barry King, again, doesn't need a real introduction because if you've been doing leather work a few days, you know exactly what he's got going on. All right, let's walk down this aisle now. Or did I skip one? I skipped one. Let's go back. All right. So here is GH Leather. That is Mr. Greg Hockhauser. He is down in Houston, Texas. He sells all kinds of great stuff. Um, he, this is a good show for him because he sells a lot, of, a lot of stuff to the boot industry. He's got a lot of great um, lining leathers and things like that. And uh, don't let me, don't let that discourage you. He's got all kinds of stuff. But um, he really, the, the leather he does carry is very top notch stuff. I've, I've bought a lot of it over the years too. Um, but he's got some great deals that he always brings to these shows. And uh, he's a pretty good guy if you catch him on the right day. So <laughs> anyway, but we're gonna get over here where we can get one of his cards. There they are. So here's one of his cards right here. Greg Hockhauser. GHLeather.com, phone number 713-670-9800. Thanks, Greg. 
All right, moving along. <laughs> I'm telling them to. I was like, buy Greg's leather. He'll give you a hug. <laughs> All right, over here, we've got Morrison Custom Saddlery. All right, Mr. Morrison here has gotten into the template game. He's making some really neat, um, unique templates that nobody else is for some of the saddle riggings and parts and things like that. He carries the, uh, the Duff's Leather Conditioning brand, which is a really good brand. I carry a couple of their products, but uh, Morrison carries a lot more than I do. So, uh, we get, he, uh, he has started making, he showed me this yesterday, but basically it's a, it's a glue spout for your bigger glue cans. So maybe we can keep guys like me from, you know, gluing the lid to the can anymore, because that's what I like to do. But uh, it's MorrisonCustomSaddlery.com, Steve Morrison, and the phone number is 9103-871. 3100 it's definitely worth a look you might want to take a look and see what all kinds of stuff you can get from him thanks steve all right here is dr glue um dr rainia here has the rainia brand of uh, he's most well known for his uh, water-based contact cement and water-based rubber cements and things like that um, he's also started making this they call it absolute black dye um, it works really, really well. I've used it on a couple of projects here recently, and I, I really like this stuff. But uh, anyway, the Rhenia products can be found through distributors or at these shows. Um, but if you have any questions or anything like that, there is a card here somewhere. Here it is. So just Rhenia.com, R-E-N-I-A.com. And uh, let me get this thing to focus on that. Focus. There we go. So anyway, the Rainia brand has uh, been around for several years, and they are growing in uh, growing in their inventory and everything else. All right. Next up is Texas Leather Trim. These guys make all kinds of piping and lace, and uh, they click out goods and just all kinds of stuff. Um, if you've ever used our Matador lace, guess who cuts it for us? Because I don't have time to sit at my lace cutter all day. <laughs> so Greg Cooper here. Do 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 do. do. Where's it at? There it is. All right. So their information is. Um, TLTL, well, tltleather.com. Their phone number is 817-535. Why is this thing not focusing on it? There we go, 535-5883. Um, you'd be amazed at the products that they can do and also the services that they can do for you. Um, they've got quite the operation going. I've seen their, uh, seen their little factory floor and it is pretty impressive. <laughs> Thanks, Greg. Just one second, guys. All right, guys, so here we have... Toscana. I'm sorry? Toscana. Toscana yeah. Vegetable Toscana Vegetable Tannery. Vegetable Tannery. All right, out of Mexico. Yes. All righty, I'm gonna zoom in on your contact information up here. There we go. There it is right there. So www.cvtoscana.com.mx is where you can find their wares. They've got a couple of samples here of their vegetable tan leathers and things. Looks pretty good to me. I've been tooling leather a long time and uh, this looks like pretty good stuff. Um, shoulders and outside. Uh, shoulders and what? And sole bend. And sole bend, okay. But y'all have a pretty wide arrangement of... We do outsoles, we do counters, we do insoles. Okay. Uh, trips for belts. Okay. And other leather accessories like for, especially for... Tubing. I got you. Okay. Or sewing. Okay. Um, wallets, uh, knife shades. Okay. So all around vegetable tannery. If you need veg tan leather, they can probably fill your needs. You also um, just use distributors, or can someone order direct from you? We we ship directly. Okay. Customers come to us directly also. Okay. We also have distributors here in the U.S. Okay. But uh, they could contact us directly, and we'll do. Okay. Excellent. So, so they do have U.S. distributors, but you can also contact them directly. So right. awesome. Thank you very much. All right. Here we have a little bit of a collaboration booth. We've got our good friends at Martin's Mix over here, Justin Martin and his lovely wife. And uh, other than that, we've got the Corville Leather uh, American Gator at its finest. And I can attest to that. They've got some amazing gators. <clears throat> 
so anyway, they, um, what I really love, I, I talked about this in the, my Waco video, but I love that some of their gators are very matte finish and they're not super shiny. Like they do have shiny, don't get me wrong, there it is. But um, like this is what I used on my, uh, my round bag video that I did and uh, it turned out really, really nice. But uh, anyway, where's your card? There it is. So Corville Leathers, thumbs right over the information I need. <laughs> so there it is, CorvilleLeather at gmail.com. And uh, all their social media can be found at, uh, at Corville Leather. So there's their phone number, 409-338-1266. And again, his, uh, his alligators are extremely clean. They're very nice and uh, they're great stuff. But we also skipped over the Martins mix here. <clears throat> so Justin Martin makes this amazing, amazing uh, edge burnishing solution called Martins Mix. And uh, they bring it to the shows and I've never heard a bad word about it. And I hear a lot of bad words, so, you know. <laughs> so anyway, Martins Mix, do you all have a website for that? or? do, yeah. MartinsMix.com. So MartinsMix.com, they keep it simple. I like it. <laughs> equals more time for the leather. There you go. <laughs> Less rubbing equals more time. There you go. All right. Now these folks I have not seen here before. This is the Gateway Shoe Machine Incorporated. Um, it looks like they have uh, some specialty sewing machine equipment and things like that. Okay. So Gateway Shoe Machines. Here's their information right here, www.gatewayshoemachine.com. They're in Lebanon, Illinois. Um, they looks like they've got some some parts and some full machines on uh, shoemaking and things like that. Sorry, I do this and I introduce all the vendors and how people can contact them and find their stuff and things like that. I uh, just had a guy actually yesterday asking me about belting for an old school machine and looks like they even have that. So actually he was looking for that staple right there that holds the belting together. And I wish I'd already known I'd have sent him right over here because he was here at this show. So anyway, they've got some really neat stuff. I'm not sure what that giant machine back there does, but I'd be interested to learn about it. So, Landis L Curve Needle. Okay. Outsole there you go, Landis L Curve um, Outsole Stitcher. So. That's a head exchange. Awesome. <laughs> All righty. Well, thank you very much. We got your uh, your website and your information out there to them. All right. And once again, I have to announce that Barb is the most beautiful woman in the world, and she's always a joy to talk to. But Barb has Why Not Lace, um, the absolute best kangaroo lace and stuff like that that you can find. All right, she's located up in Montana. She used to spend some of her time in Texas, but she doesn't do that anymore, so we're sad. <laughs> Texas was a better place when she was here. Uh, <laughs> so anyway, their, their website is www.why notlace.com, okay? The letter Y, the word not, K-N-O-T, lace.com. And uh, Barb's got all kinds of great kangaroo lace, um, some great tools for splitting and beveling lace and things like that. And uh, overall, she's an amazing person, so she's definitely worth doing business with. So, thanks Barb, we love you. All right, over here we have the Artisan Cowhides folks. They have Artisan Cowhides. <laughs> How's it going, guys? Um, so Artisan Cowhides, they've got lots of uh, printed leathers, um, cowhides, of course, and things like that. Looks like they've got the acid wash cowhides. This one's really cool. I've never seen anything like that. I'll be back to talk to them about this one here in a little bit. So you can't have it. It's already mine. So uh, anyway, but you guys are in Fort Worth? Dallas. Dallas, OK. Yes, sir. That's all one big city nowadays. <laughs> um, you got a card or something I can get your information off of? All right, so Artisan Cowhides LLC. Um, is there a website? Yeah, the website. Oh, there it is on the back. Yeah. There we go. All right, so it's just artisancowhides.com. If you're not a website person, their phone number is 469-466-9404. They've got some really cool stuff here, and I'm going to be back to talk to them as soon as I'm done recording this. Thanks, guys. All right, over here we've got my good friend Don Gonzalez, his lovely wife Claudia, and their kids are somewhere. <laughs> I hear that a lot. <laughs> um, Don's here selling his wares, his patterns and things like that, and uh, just generally getting to talk to folks about leather. He's got all of his uh, um, 
material packs, his clicked out pieces and things like that that he sells. Um, his patterns are just absolutely awesome and really easy to use. But uh, his stuff can be found at dgsaddlery.com, phone number 979-775-6300. But there's Don right there. All right, next I've got my friend C. Loy. Uh, Mr. Loy is out of El Paso area in Texas. Um, he has lots of great, great leathers. Um, he, he specializes in um, goat skin and um, kid skin and things like that. He's got a lot of really great um, thinner leathers that um, boot makers and, and wallet makers and stuff really, really like. Um, Loy is a good guy. He's a veteran, even if it is a Marine. Um, but he's a good man. So anyway, it's uh, www.cloysleather.com. Again, they're in the El Paso area in Texas, so uh, if you're needing something, give them a call. I'm going to pause this for a minute and take a break, and we'll come back and do the rest of the booths. All right, we are back. This is a directly across from C. Loy's booth there, but this is Silver Designs, Steve Hargrove, Mounds, Oklahoma. Um, looks like... Not seeing a website, but silverdesignsonline at gmail.com is their contact information. But we're going to walk through here. They've got silver sets for uh, tack and saddles and head stalls and things like that, belts, whatever you could need uh, something like that for. Um, very reasonably priced, it looks like, but they've got some really neat sets set up here. Um, they also have a, a table of uh, miscellaneous jewelry that they've made and things like that. But um, this, is, uh, this is some really neat hardware and stuff. And they've got lots of it. So if you're looking for a special set for a, for a special project or something like that, it might be worth it to uh, give them a shout. Because they may have exactly what you're looking for. So again, here's all their, their jewelry stuff. Hopefully Janie Sue doesn't see all this, but we'll see. Hopefully I can keep her busy. <laughs> All right, so there it is. We're going to move along here to Magna Leather. I'm so sorry. Bumped into somebody there. Magna Leather. They have a lot of exotics here, um, but they also have some, looks like some finished goods type stuff here. Um, they've done some really cool shoes with some of their exotics. Um, whoop, my camera's going nuts on me here. All right, they've got some really cool uh, shoes and things that they've done with their exotics. Um, I've been kind of eyeballing these all weekend. They're pretty, pretty neat, pretty wild in some cases, but uh, pretty awesome in some cases too. Um, this says that they, this sign here says that they are handcrafted in Texas, so that's pretty badass. They got lots of this big old piracu fish thing here. I think that's how you say it. I don't know. I've used them on a couple of projects. I actually made a pair of shoes out of them once, but um, lots of pythons, uh, caimans. All kinds of stuff like that. We'll get over here and we'll get their contact information and uh, you can uh, get a hold of them if you need something. So, steal your card here, guys. All right, Let's see if that'll focus on that. But it says www.alligatorbeltsbymagna.com. All right. Um, I don't think that ever did focus. There we go. So their phone number is 915-772-0004, and they're in the El Paso area here in Texas. So again, lots of great exotics and skins and things like that. If you're looking for anything like that, I bet they can help you out. Give them a call. Excuse me, guys. All right. This booth, yep, you'll be on my YouTube channel. <laughs> All right. I've got 35,000 subscribers now, so yeah. All right, so over here, from here, all the way over there and then over here too is my booth this is the makers leather supply booth this is our biggest show we bring the biggest amount of inventory to this show and it takes us a whole day to unpack it all get it out get it going and then repack it all and put it back in a trailer and get it home so we always hope to sell it so we did bring in some leathers just for this show and um, there's going to be plenty of it when we get home. And so guess what's going to happen on the uh, next Odd Lot sale? There's just going to be all kinds of cool stuff. So, yeah. So again, here's the whole Maker's Leather Supply booth. We're still walking by the Maker's Leather Supply booth. It's a big booth. 
<laughs> Alright, now not to skip everybody else. Very next uh, up to bat is the American Tanning and Leather. Hi, how's it going? Hi. They've got lots of very, very, very nice alligator. Um, really, uh, really high quality stuff. You don't see a lot of the scarring and things like that that you do on the wild gators that are caught. Um, but anyway, for three years now, they've had a booth directly across from mine, and they've always been very, very impressed with the skins that they've got. And uh, if y'all got a card, I can get some contact information for folks. Podcasting? Mm, um, it's uh, for my YouTube channel. YouTube? Wow. Yeah, we've got 35,000 subscribers and they all love these show videos. Amazing. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, their website is, uh, where's it at? AMTAN.com. So, www.amtan.com. And uh, they are in Griffin, Georgia, it looks like. And we They're, have an app at an online store where individual makers can buy one skin at a time and actually see a picture of the actual skin they're gonna get. Awesome. All right, so y'all heard her say that. Okay, that was Christy Gilmore from, from uh, American Tanning and Leather. She said they have an app where individual makers can go on and see the actual skin that they would be purchasing and things like that. Uh, really nice folks. All right, next we have the Larson Leather Company. Um, Eric Larson sells all kinds of exotics, I mean every kind of exotic and every color and every finish, um, like such as that very, very beautiful blue elephant right there. All right, um, Larson Leather Company has been around quite a while and they're very trusted in the industry. They have a very good name in the industry. I'm going to find one of their cards here so I can show you how to get a hold of them too. But uh, good folks. Y'all got a... Yeah, Gilberto, y'all have a card? I'm doing my video. Do y'all have a card? I can show everybody how to get a hold of y'all. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are you currently live on a video? Not live. I was going to say, I'll better yeah. watch my mouth then. Yeah. <laughs> They'll hear me. Don't worry. <laughs> All right. So real easy, uh, www.larsonleather.com. Oh, LarsonLeatherCo.com. Sorry about that. Um, they uh, Their office number is 817-399-0044. And again, they've got, a, as far as selection goes, I think they probably have more stuff in one company than most of these others combined. They, uh, they really do have a lot. All right. Right over here, we have Ostrich and Alligator Market. All right, once again, um, ostriches, alligators. Looks like we've got some shark skins here. He's always got some really cool skulls laying around. I've always been very impressed with his skulls. Um, he does sell uh, scraps of tails and things like that. And uh, he's, his booth has been next to ours for years. Really good folks. Um, they do a great job. Here's a Jamaican themed, uh, that's Jamaica, right? Yeah. Jamaican themed uh, skull right there. He had one yesterday with a Texas flag, but it might have sold because I don't see it. Um, there's their card right there. Oh, you can buy online. So there we go, Ostrich and Alligator Market. Um, the website is ostrichmarket.com. But uh, give them a call. They are in Melbourne, Florida, and they've got lots of great stuff. All right, let's walk around the corner. We got one more row to go, guys. All right, here we have Mr. Jesse Smith. There's more knowledge in this booth than most of these other booths will ever have. Um, but Jesse Smith has been an amazing leather worker and saddle maker for a very, very long time. He lives in Pritchett, Colorado, I believe. Yep, Pritchett, Colorado. Um, he does um, a lot of teaching. He has a lot of great pattern packs for uh, his Northwest style of uh, tooling and things like that. Um, Jesse's just an all around great cowboy and a hell of a guy to know. Um, I've never seen him mad, but you know, he's always got a smile on his face, but I'd, I'd be deathly afraid of the day he doesn't have that smile, so. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Where? Yeah. So uh, jessesmith8 at gmail.com is how you can get a hold of him, or his phone number is 719-469-2482. There we go. Thanks, Jesse. All right, here we have Pro Series Tools by Bob Beard, but Bob Beard looks like he's out playing hooky right this very minute. He's uh, 
he, I guess when you're Bob Beard, you get to do that, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, Pro Series Tools um, has been a extremely well-known name in the industry for a very long time. He has, Bob has invented tools that can do things that no other tool can do. Um, he always comes with a very impressive display of what his tools can do, and then he always has some that are readily made and, and ready to sell, um, as well as he'll take orders for specific tools if you're looking for them. Um, yeah, here we go. Here's an example of Bob's work right here. Um, I'm not sure if you can tell on the camera, but that's about three inches deep at least. But uh, Bob is very well known for these type of scenery uh, pictorials and things like that that um, he just is an incredible artist. So there he's gonna open up another one to show us. So there we go, this one's even deeper. It's probably even four inches deep going all the way back. Let me get in there and show the, the layers going on there. So just some amazing artwork that Bob's been known for for his years. and. Uh, he, uh, he teaches a lot of classes, and uh, if, you can, if you're ever lucky enough to get into one of his classes, it's, uh, you will learn a lot, and you will be glad you did. So, Pro Series Tools, where's, um, y'all got a card that I can, how to get a hold of Bob? There it is, thank you. Uh, no. <laughs> Slickball said Bob doesn't want you to get a hold of him. <laughs> Bob's getting to be a cranky old man like everybody else. So, <laughs> his phone number is 505-632. 7039. He lives in Farmington, New Mexico, but uh, basically you need to call him because you're not going to find him. <laughs> you got to get through Johnny first. Yeah. All right, moving along. So this is Chris Andre, also known as Slickbald uh, Booth. Um, Chris has been bringing some antique tools and things like that and also hard to find tools. This is actually John Bianchi's personal collection. Oh, well. Most of it. And then, of course, there's also John Bianchi's personal collection, most of it. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, but um, he brought some uh, some rare holster uh, molds and things like that because Blue Guns doesn't make everything. And um, anyway, he's got some great tools here and stuff. Um, and cheap, he says. That's the $5 table. The $5 table, that's what I'm talking about. The one I can afford. So anyway, um, Chris Andre also teaches uh, holster making and leather working and things like that in his own shop in what, where in Colorado? Uh, north of Denver. North of Denver in Colorado. Um, his, uh, his work is amazing. He is an Al Stolman Award winner, uh, and he is very widely known and recognized in the industry as a pretty okay guy. So. I'll accept that. <laughs> I'll take that. So anyway, um, where can we get a hold of you? Uh, slickbald at slickbald.com. There you go. Slickbald at slickbald.com. So easy enough. <laughs> Thanks, Chris. All right, here we have Leather Master Sewing Machines, another sewing machine company up in Dallas, Texas. They've got all kinds of different models of uh, uh, heavy duty sewing machines and things like that. Um, yeah, their phone number is 214-536-1100. Um, also, sewmaxindustrial.com is their website, it looks like. And it uh, looks like they've got a pretty wide range of different machinery and things like that. And if you don't see it on this video, I'd be willing to bet you can call them and they can help you find it if they don't already have it in stock. So, uh, yeah. All the numbers and everything are up to date on that? Okay, because that's what I read off. So, <laughs> excellent. All right, thank you, sir. Here we have our friends at Texas Leather Goods. They're working, they're working hard, I can tell. So, uh, what's y'all's website? Here it is. Texas Leather Goods has lots of uh, really great uh, printed leathers and also their, um, they've got a lot of uh, cowhides and things like that. Um, they have some very unique leathers you won't find anywhere else, but it's just texasleathergoods.com. They're in, it says Carrollton, but to me everything on that side of town is called Dallas, so they're up there somewhere. Um, but anyway, really good folks. They have an amazing, uh, amazing place up there. Um, their warehouse is just a sight to see and uh, they're good people to, to hang out with and get to talk to, but they've got some great leathers. All right, over here we have our rep from C.S. Osborne. He doesn't actually, I don't believe he sells things at the show. He just comes to show off C.S. Osborne tools and talk about their, uh, their things that they have and all that. Um, other than that, if you want C.S. Osborne stuff, you get it through a, uh, a distributor like Maker's Leather Supply. So <laughs> anyway. Thank you, sir. All right. Yes. 
like that. Excuse me. Yeah. I like that. Thank you for What's promoting that? us. Yeah, that's what I, every every show. I walk around, do a video, introduce all the, the exhibitors and what they do, and yeah. Super. Yep. All right. All right, over here we have Traditions Leathercraft. They're in Yukon, Oklahoma. They, uh, that's on, um, that's a, basically, it's a suburb of Oklahoma City is where they're at. Um, they're pretty well known. They're a very gr fast growing company. Um, they, uh, they have uh, lots of great tooling leathers and all kinds of other leathers. They sell a lot of cowhides and things like that. They, uh, they brought a pretty good showing here to this show. But I uh, hope when we get up there, we can see you. But uh, anyway, it's uh, traditionsleather.com, right? Okay, traditionsleather.com is where you can find their stuff, and uh, they'll get you taken care of you if you need anything. So, there we go. On to the next one, a little bit of a walk. All right, over here we have JB Custom Leather. I've seen them at several shows. They sell some uh, a lot of used tools and machinery for boot and shoe uh, trade, mostly boots. Um, they've got, I mean, these look like some tools that I don't regularly see, so I'm sure they're one of those companies that if you're looking for it and you can't find it, I bet they can find it or already have it for you. They always bring some, some sewing machines and things like that to these shows, and um, they, I bet they're a heck of a resource for information and stuff like that. Let me see if I can find their, uh, there it is, there's their contact information right up there. Western Boots and Custom Leather Goods, 303-946-4930, um, leatherfabrication.com. All right, we got one more booth and then I'm gonna go and do a separate video on the boot and, sh boot and saddle making competitions. But here's Pan American Leathers. Um, Pan American, once again, lots of great exotics. Uh, no here works for them. She's busy with a customer, but I'm sure she'll at least wave. Hi. So um, anyway, they've got lots of great exotics and knows is a wealth of information. She, uh, she designs some very nice uh, designer level um, custom bags and things like that. And uh, she's uh, gaining a, a name for herself as an instructor at some of these shows and things. But um, anyway, let's see. Uh, panamleathers.com is their website and 978-741-4150 is their number and then Noah herself is uh, Noah Leem Noah there we go um, so it's Noah Greenspan and her number or her it's noahleem.com and her number is 347-337-0915 now, she's got some of her purses and things over here, and I will show those off, but I'm also very impressed with what she does with her scraps. Have you ever seen a python horse? I hadn't either, but now I have. Okay, things like that. She makes some of the coolest little animals and uh, charms, I guess you would call it. There's a stingray made out of not stingray. Like, what the hell? <laughs> and a gator out of gator. There you go. Finally, something matches. Um, but then here's some of her handbags and uh, and things like that. She does a really great job. She uh, she does fantastic work, um, and she's a heck of a designer. So, definitely an asset to the industry. So, that was a lot of talking. Sorry about that. Um, again, I'm Aaron Heiser, Makers Leather Supply. This is the 36th annual boot and saddle making um, trade show here in Wichita Falls, Texas. It'll happen again the first uh, first weekend of next October as well. And you, uh, you owe it to yourself to come pay a visit at it. So until next time, we'll see you later.